let's take a look at a quick sound design project that uses the Unmix Components process. Now this process is just one of several Spectre Layers processes that actually generate their own new layers to work with. And I'll show you how it works. Listen to this kalimba clip. Up here in the Unmix menu, I'm exercising the Unmix Components process. The process generates three new layers, tonal, transient, and noise. The AI-assisted process here did a great job of sorting tones, transients, and noise. Now, let's go in and start making refinements. Listen to the tonal layer soloed again. Okay, this is a good result, but we can easily clean it up by using tools and layers. Now here, I'm selecting everything around the kalimba sound. Hit the spacebar to hear the selection. If I wish, I can save the selection in case I need to go back to it. Simply go to the Select menu and choose Save Selection. Give it a name, and you're good to go. But as it is, I'm not going back to the selection. I'm just going to hit the Delete key and remove the selected content from the layer. Listen to the transient layer. Now here I'm doing the exact same thing in order to isolate the kalimba transient. Delete, and here's the result. Now I have the transient layer selected, and I'm performing a merge up operation. And now the transient layer content has been incorporated into the tonal layer. Okay, now I'm dragging the tonal layer into the Cubase project timeline, and at this point, our work in Spectra Layers has concluded, so I'm removing the extension. Now, the extracted Columbia layer exists as an independent audio file in the media pool. And finally, here I've created a sound bed using the bubbling sounds from the original clip, and I've produced the kalimba sound that I extracted using the AI-assisted process called Unmix Components, along with some work with manual tools and layers and spectra layers. Spectra Layer stands apart from other audio editors in that several of its processes automatically generate layers. In these layer generating processes, no content is ever lost or deleted. Of course, content can be selected with the manual tools and deleted, like we did here, or it can be shifted from layer to layer subsequent to processing to refine and enhance your work. And this unique and very important functionality is one of the many things that makes Spectral Layers the most capable Spectral Audio Editor available today. We hope you enjoyed this video. Spectral Layers delivers state-of-the-art spectral processing for editors in every field. Subscribe to the Steinberg YouTube channel and learn more about how you can leverage this application in your production workflow.